the hype, all the buzz tonight is the night that we all see why everyone's talking about the X Factor. Yeah, the X Factor debuts tonight. Casey is here to give us a preview. Good morning. Good morning, and the hype is so worth it. I know a lot of people are like, everybody keeps talking about it. There's a reason we keep talking about it. And last week, we got to spend some time in Los Angeles with the stars. And in addition to the lovely judges, we met the very lovely, <clears throat> Lily, you're going to want to watch this guy because he's hot, host, UK native Steve Jones. The X Factor is not a new show there, so I asked him if he's noticed a big difference between between the British and American audiences who's packing those stadiums behind the judges for these auditions. British audiences can be a bit less forgiving. Really? Yes. I think, basically, I think with the X Factor in, in the UK, we've had a head start. It's like an eight to nine year head start now, if, I, if I'm right. So people tend to judge right off the bat. If somebody comes out, they're not good. British people are like, booth, get off, rubbish. <laughs> you know, because they're, they're, they're au okay fait with, with the process. but. American audiences differed in the sense that they, I noticed, they were very polite. Somebody would come out <laughs> and they wouldn't be great, and the American audiences would be like, oh, well, no, come on now, Simon, give, it, give them a chance, <laughs> let them, and then about half an hour later, they're all, boo, get off, you rubbish. <laughs> so talk to us a little bit about your role in the show. Obviously, we know about the four judges, but as host, are you the liaison between the judges, the audience, and the auditioners, or what is, what is the, the main focus of your role in, in The X Factor? I'm kind of a conduit between the viewer and the acts. You know, I'm, I'm the guy who's asking the questions that hopefully you want to ask. How are these people are feeling after, you know, receiving the forked end of Simon's tongue? <laughs> you know, that's kind of my role is to... It, it, it's a tough role, to be honest with you. If someone's come off that stage and all they want to do is, is hold their mother because they've just been told that they're not going to be a superstar, I still have to get in there and try and pull out a response from them. You, it's not great TV just seeing somebody go mm -hmm. and not speaking. You want to, how do you feel about what, how do you feel about what just happened? And it's it's perfect for me because you know I, so I have an inquiry. So even when he makes that face, he's cute, right, Lily? I didn't even hear a word he said. <laughs> we were both just like. Go ahead, what do you say? Cut. You want to recap know. for me? Yeah, he's saying he's talking about. First of all, we should we should mention the biggest difference between um, Idol and X Factor is that these preliminary auditions aren't taking place in a tiny room, and some of the judges are going to speak oh. to this coming up in the next hour. But they are stepping on stage with 4,000 people behind the judges. So he was talking about how in America they were a little bit more prim and proper about it, yeah. waiting to boo until perhaps 10 minutes in. Um, it's it's it's. I've seen the first couple of episodes, and you're really going to like it. It's it's a little bit edgier. Than I thought it would well, be. Well, there's my one reason to watch. <laughs> Bill, Bill, don't you think he's good looking? Oh, he's dreamy. Bill's like, no sure. Sure. These sure guys have been drooling over this guy all morning <laughs> long. I haven't heard anything but. Oh, I'm sorry. So. No, it's okay. You are also a very good looking guy. Oh, well, thank you very much. <laughs> don't okay. you that was pity, but I that's know. okay. I'm sorry, Bill. Well, coming up next hour, we're going to chat with fellow judge and record exec L.A. Reid. But first, he's back. I'm going to subtitle, I think, the second half of the show, because Seattle's in show one, Seattle, The Redemption. Oh, I like it. Starts off badly, but it gets better. <laughs> the wait is over for Simon and The X Factor. It premieres tonight at 8 p.m. with a two-hour show featuring the Seattle auditions. Simon, Paula, L.A. Reid, and Pussycat Doll Nicole Scherzinger join host Steve Jones. Another two-hour episode airs tomorrow night at 8. Don't forget, after both, to watch Q13 Fox News at 10 immediately following.